Hi everybody. Uh, I was just about to open this and I just realized uh, the makers of Benelin. Okay, and I'm talking about other products too, medicine bottles like this. I just noticed there's no safety ring around this lid. There's nothing like that on here. There's no ceram, whatever you want to call them. There's no safety ring on this safety tab on there that you know that this bottle hasn't been tampered with. And I sure hope it ain't. Uh, with this kind of bottle, always check, quote, always check. I'm gonna. Okay. Easily. Okay, I'm opened. Okay, see? Now look. See? Sharan. Okay. Well, you know, you know what I'm talking about. See, you can get a syringe. See how easy was it that I could just take the cap right off? Okay. And it came off the counter. Okay. Anybody that can be a fool, an idiot, that can take a syringe, fill it up with any kind of chemical they want, easily put a, a needle in here, anywhere. And usually some people will not really look at thank god i'm looking nothing okay she's no tampering but you could easily some people would just open it and lift off the saran paper you know and use the bottle use the medicine anybody can actually put a syringe in here anywhere with a small small syringe needle and put whatever they want in there okay and uh Hopefully that won't happen because if it does happen, the makers of Benelin did not put the safety ring on the bottle, on the cap. So we know that it hasn't been tampered with. Anybody can go into the store and hey, look around. Only takes about five seconds. Put everyone in there and close the lid and put it back on the shelf. So Benelin, you got a good bottle here. It helps, it helps me a lot. But anyways, just to let you guys know, you got a, you got a, you got a product here that is unsafe. So if you guys can actually uh, start putting, because mostly all medicine bottles should, and most I do have, what do you call that, hon? On the bottle? The safety ring. The safety, safety ring. That goes right around it, tight, airtight. The only way to take it off, you gotta pry it off with your fingers. All right? Those are supposed to be there, so let's the consumers know that the bottle hasn't been tampered with. This bottle came right off the shelf less than two hours ago, and uh, you just see me open it. There was no safety ring or nothing around it. But anyways, I checked I checked it. There's nothing been tampered with. There's no holes or nothing in there. But always, if you see a bottle like this, always check. If you have a bottle that doesn't have the safety ring around it, that holds that cap on tightly, knowing that it's safe. If you don't if there's one that doesn't have one, open her up and check the seal see if the seal hasn't been tampered with see if there's no holes sometimes you know hold her up see if nothing comes out of it nothing came out so here we go opened now she's ready to be used okay but There we go. 
that's just a reminder to most people don't take a chance always if you have one that does not have no safety ring around it no plastic airtight plastic that holds the cap tightly onto the bottle if they don't have one always check after you open it always check see if that has been tampered with okay if you think it's tampered with take it back to the consumer you got it from and they can deal with it all right but anyways I thought you guys like to know about that but anyways uh, it's pretty well right hun yeah. yeah so always check your bottle but anyways I thought I might as well say what I have to say. But anyways, there you go.